What's going on, everybody, and welcome back to the channel. My name is Harris. I am once again joined by Justin, and today we'll be reacting to episode 13 of It's Okay to Not Be Okay. Yep, that's right, guys. Can't believe we're only four episodes left of this amazing show. We're going to enjoy every last bit of our girl and seeing how this, everything wraps up. Um, before we get started, I just want to say I thought a little bit more about the theory I threw out there last week. And if anybody's interested, you can go check out the discussion in the last episode. And I think it's pretty crazy, so don't don't roast me too bad. Like I, I I just threw that out there, but it's probably not true. So don't don't go roasting me too bad about it. For anybody who wants to know what I'm talking about, just check out the discussion in last week's episode. But anyway, so last week's episode we got the I guess big reveal that we kind of uh, it was set up that way, right? That. Moon Young's mom had killed Gong Tae and Song Tae's mom. The confirmation, I should say. We kind of got breadcrumbs up until that point. And then Gong Tae found out and we saw basically the aftermath of how he processed it, right? Yeah, pretty much. Um, what's it called? We, we got that nice little, we got that nice little ending, right? You know, with the photo shoot and everything. So. I mean, but to get uh, there was like a struggle, right? Like, I understand the feelings yeah. he had to go through to get there. It's like... How can you, I mean, it's not Moon Young's fault, right? But every time you see her, you think like, oh, your mom killed my mom. So it's, it's very tough. But that's, like, you, oh, that's go ahead. tough. That, that, yeah. That's tough. Well, I got, like, <clears throat> you can't, you can't blame her at the end of the day. It's, it's not her. It's the mom. Um, I just like, why the fuck did that happen? Though? Like, what was the context? You know what I'm saying? I need to know more of the context. Because you can't just go into a fucking tunnel and just stab her in the neck, right? Like, what's... Th there's, there's more to that. Oh, for sure. I mean, like, even in the little flashback we got from Sanke when he followed the cat, and then we don't know what happened that led, like you said, to the point where the mom, Gangte and Sanke's mom, ended up in the tunnel with Moon Young's mom. Like, how do we get from point A to point B? So maybe we'll get to see from Moon Young's mom's perspective, because she still has to make an appearance, right? She is alive. Yes. As we yes. uh, have guessed, like they said that Moon Young had said that she had a wound on her head, but then vanished. So she's out there somewhere. The question is, when is she going to make her reappearance? Also, where the heck is Miss Park Okran? Like she's disappeared too. So there's still a lot of things that need to be answered. And I guess we're going to start to wrap things up. Uh, but I guess too, she also mentioned before we get into the episode, the the patient we kind of focused on last week's episode was Mr. Uh, Khan, right? Khan mm -hmm. was his name. Yeah, so, we had the the PTSD, like the flashbacks, in that bus, which was probably one of the most breathtaking like scenes ever, right? Like that's just that scene was just so fucking crazy, like how they did it and everything like that, just to show, like the experience. Yeah, I really like how they showcase certain things, like you mentioned that scene, even like back in the previous like episodes, the way they choose to highlight how each person experiences things, right? And kind of really uh, just puts things in perspective and really shows kind of what people go through when like we don't truly understand, right? And that what the show is trying to, I guess, tell us is like, hey, this is what these people go through when they go through these things. Mm -hmm. And you need to be able to understand that. And like Sanke, he was the only one on the bus who helped him. Everybody else had no idea what was going on. So, That's so right. I guess, you know, just trying if to... If he wasn't there, the situation would have played out 100, like a lot differently. For sure, we have no idea how bad it could have gotten. So it's it's definitely good that the show is trying to show like, hey, if somebody's going through something, don't just assume that uh, it's like a bad thing. They might need your help. So I do yeah. like how that show does that. And uh, I'm excited kind of to see what we do with this episode and what they kind of tried to tell us here. Yeah, I need more answers. I need to see I, I need to see a happy resolution between our king and queen. Um, mm -hmm. So. I can't wait to see what episode 13 brings us. Uh, if you've been liking It's Okay to Not Be Okay, and I know a ton of you have, just be sure that you hit the like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And if you want to join us uh, more and support us more on there than by watching us here on YouTube, join the Patreon. You can see the full uncut reactions. If you're impatient, join the Patreon. I'm just saying. Um, we're ahead on Patreon. And by the time this is out on YouTube, I think we'll, we'll be already done. Um, so just if you want to catch up, just join us. And uh, we appreciate all the patrons who have been supporting us at this point. And with that, let's get right into episode 13. I mean, that's true, too. It's like we didn't even, I didn't even mention that. It's like when that butterfly has 
not only killed their mom, but caused everything in their life to lead up to this point, right? All of Sang Tae's uh, PTSD and all the moving they've had to do is all because of this. So, yep. it's, yeah. And the irony now is that he wants her to be the empty can, right? So that she can't feel pain rather than before he was chastising her for being the empty can. It's crazy what this show's doing. I know. <laughs> Bro, what? Oh. Dude. 10 out of 10 wife, man. <laughs> that would have made me go too. <laughs> Bang, this is fucking... This is sending like a chill down, you know? I'm just like, oh, I'm so happy. So and we know some fuck shit's gonna happen at the end though, which is making me like keep my emotions in check. I'm but just, I'm so I'm just happy like this, too. this, this fucking the show loves to get me up in the highs and then just bringing me down. Where's it? Give me a smile. Give me a smile. Give me a smile. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yeah. Yeah. The family Ooh. portrait. Chef's kiss. <laughs> Gonna Photoshop you in the fucking picture. <laughs> Jeez. Jeez. <laughs> the father of the two sisters. Can we go find out Moon Young has a sister? Stop. <laughs> She's about I, to play it cool. I, I, I thought it was going to be like a buzz off kind of thing. <laughs> Oh, there you go, buzz off. <laughs> oh, don't talk about. Nope, nope. <laughs> don't talk about her, man, bro. Don't, don't talk about her, man. I have a feeling she's gonna get jealous in this episode. There's gonna be some girls checking her out. Yep, yep. <laughs> yep. Oh, she could take his advice. Okay. That's right. Say your peace. Let's go. This and feels this feels really bad considering that Moon Young's mom is the one that Well no Moon, we know Moon Young's mom did things to her, right? Didn't Moon Young say that her mom like trapped her and so maybe yeah. he's also saying that I won't let your mom do the same things to you or Sangte. Well, I might have probably took it that the wrong way. No cap. <laughs> I mean she's part of the family, he said. She is. See, like, she's here, she could protect you too, you know? The queen rules all. Oh, I was like, yeah, the smile, uh, man, gets you every time. The smile kills me. It's a shot to my heart. Is he gonna try to be like our dad? Yeah, just somebody to be there for her. Uh, Come on. I want to see Jerry get a W. Uh, yeah, yeah. Okay, no, she's baby. saying... Uh, yeah. That, that's what I thought. Okay, I understand. Okay, oh. they definitely don't want that. Let's, I, I get that. Well, the ghosts are in there. Okay, like build your own house. Don't like forget the past. You build your own future. I like this. <laughs> Mm. 
그래야 그 나비 확실히 죽여줄게. 너 알지? 난 나비 잡는 킬러인 거. That's true. We have seen in the past right. that she does right. do that. You r i Oh, 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 oh! Come on, t h a t just a hug. What bro. you doing, bro? What you doing? Okay, I just got this in my head as soon as she said that. I wonder if that's why she ripped the butterflies because she can kill the butterfly for them. That's that's like putting the hold on them. Was that like that symbolism from episode one supposed to be? So I was like, oh shit! Oh, so is she gonna be the one to he like help them move past the butterfly pin, which is her mom? That's why she'll rip the butterfly. Oh, okay, that that's clever, ah. show. That's clever. Okay. Hey, 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 Pinky promise. Uh, all important. They're important. See you with a kiss. Yep. You never break that shit. Oh. <laughs> he knows. He knows. He's putting you on the spot, bro. Oh, he does know. Oh. Yeah, that's it's just a peck. It's just a peck. Huh? <clears throat> oh, Miss Park Okra Okran didn't write them. Okay, that makes sense. So that means she was given these notes. So okay, so maybe okay, so somebody so maybe somebody told Miss uh, Okran to hey play this part, and the person who told her was probably Moon Young's mom. Moon Young's mom. I need to know what her game is. What the heck does Moon Young's mom want? Oh, oh, look at that. Yo, let's go, Sangte. Oh, relax, relax. Who is this bitch? <laughs> oh, that's Miss Yu. So the person that's showing up is is it her? Is it like a different personality? DID. Okay. <coughs> oh. Oh. Oh my god. Oh no. Oh, is he dying? Wow, is she actually not gonna get one more conversation with him? I thought there was actually gonna be one more conversation. Yeah, I thought he had more time, but. I don't think she likes any of the drawings. Interesting. I thought it would be good. He'd be good at it because he can read them pretty well. So I, is he saying that because he he's good at he's good at reading he's great at reading faces. So like is he saying that if I drew what I look at I'm drawing other people's faces and that's not my work is that what he's saying? Yeah, make your own facial expression because maybe maybe he doesn't feel like they're his uh, own. Well, yeah, because if he looks and copies, that's I mean that's like it's not his. It's also plagiarism. <laughs> true, true. I guess his interpretation of what each feeling is supposed to be. <laughs> She's like, oh, great. My ideal type is you. Come on, say it. Yeah. Oh. That's not it. But it's what hers is, so hey. That's my daughter. No, 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 don't fuck you, blowing it. Oh my god, bro, he fumbled it so bad. He fumbled the bag, man. He fumbled the fucking bag. Like your father, what the stop talking, you don't. Bruh. I mean, to be fair, if you don't want to, you shouldn't be forced to, but it, it could it could be good, maybe. 
Yeah, that's true. Mm-hmm. Yep. So tell him. Just go tell him how it feels. And... Huh. Is she saying that's what her dad did, like, with her mom and her? What? What? <laughs> what? Oh no. I think he's gonna apologize though. Dude. This hurts, man. <laughs> I... This sucks. I, I can't even say anything to this. This is I, just I terrible, no man. Yeah. This is bullshit. Man. And I guess and he, he just knows. leaves. I think he knows he screwed up. He has nothing. He can't say anything, right? What, what can he say? Dang, the fact that they brought the young girl for this part, that hurts even more. <laughs> Yo, everybody needs this, man. Everybody needs a friend that they can talk to, right? Just... Somebody that you can bounce things off of. Everybody needs that one night to get plastered, bro. <laughs> I like this. This is good. This is the healing that we need. So he did probably hit her then after he found out. Okay, so that is what happened. Oh. Oh, oh God, okay. Oh, fuck. So she oh, saw that she doesn't know why too, right? She just sees her dad push her mom over the balcony of the staircase. Fuck. It's a lot of blood though. It's a lot of blood. <laughs> Oh wait, no, he dumped he the body. He dumped her. Would end up like her. Yeah. Okay, so it all, it all makes sense ah. now. Yeah. <clears throat> and that's where Gong Tae comes into that's the picture. That's where Gong Tae yeah. comes in, yeah. Is that why she writes? Yeah, I think that's why she writes. That's probably like the gift that I guess he gave her. Yeah. I mean, even with all the stuff that they've been through, right? That's still your dad, right? <laughs> Hmm. Man, so they had some good memories. Yeah. Wow, she can see what he's been going through too. Yes. Yo, she gives the best advice, man. 
she right there that's the best mom dude yes no cap i agree i agree i like the idea yeah build your own future build a new house okay Oh. Wow. Okay. Whoa. 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 We're moving fast. We're okay. going quick. I mean, I know we only have three episodes left, but. Huh? Interesting. Okay. Oh. For what? To figure out oh. inspiration? No, I think because remember we got that flashback a few episodes ago? That oh, because he wants a uniform. Yeah, he yeah he missed school, right? Because he probably had to keep moving with Gan K, right? When they were young, so he never got yeah, to go to school. He never got okay. to go to school. Yeah. Oh. I'm getting nervous. I'm getting very nervous. That's the butterfly pin. It's the small oh, no. on top of the big. Oh my oh, God! No. The mom is oh, here. Oh my God! Somebody fucking ruined it. The mom is here. The mom is here. Oh, and she knows what that is. Too. Why oh, does this hallway always bring about pain, man? We had the Song King Gong K fight here, now we're gonna have this. Oh, and the lady that killed my mom. Now Moon Young knows who that is. Oh, good God, this is disaster. Oh, no. Fuck, man. So we did have a villain in the show the mom. Shit. No, it's... Oh, goodness. <laughs> oh, just fucking kick me in the goddamn face. All right, please tell me who the mom is. I need to know. What the heck? Wait. No. It's Miss Park. No, what the fuck? No way. Are you joking? What That's the Ms. fuck? Is she the mom? Uh, that didn't look like her though. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That Hey yo, what the fuck? What? So Miss Park is the mom. <clears throat> Miss Park's the fucking mom. Why'd you kill them? Why'd you kill her? Yo, what? I'm speechless right now. I gotta process my thoughts. <laughs> okay, so Miss Park is the mom. So that's she. That's why she. That's why she got like all teary eyed when you know she kind of had like more fucking attention to the dad when he was like in the padded room and stuff like that so she had to get like some face surgery that's not the same woman face wise no it right? looks like she's got some work done yeah so two reasons did she had to get the work done because her face got messed up after the fall or did she do it to disguise herself to do all this fuck shit that she's been doing now that's what i'm, I'm thinking lean towards disguise because she's evil yeah, I, I guess. So that I guess has she just been behind this because she's been here since like episode three. She's, yeah, she's so she's been behind the scenes, just fucking she, shit up. She fucking infiltrated. So then, what was her goal to watch the dad die? Because that she revealed herself after the dad died, right? So it's like, okay, dad's dead. Yeah. Then I'll draw the butterfly. So did she wait for the dad to die, and then it's like, okay, now I can go after Moon Young? Um. So... Oh, okay, then this brings up what we brought about too. There's a reason that they were both named Miss Park, man. That was definitely like a clue. We have Miss Park, Okran, and then Miss Park. That's the, right? So there was definitely a reason. That's probably, yeah. that was like a hint for like, obviously okay. you don't realize the hint until the end, I guess, but that was definitely a hint. It's like, okay. So, so, I mean, she went by Miss Park, even though she's Dohi J. Yes. Oh, hmm. All right. <sighs> oh, my God. Okay. Now I'm just okay, trying to so think maybe, back throughout the okay, rest. Okay, I think that probably debunks the theory. 
potentially. No, it definitely does. Well, okay, now I'm starting to think. You remember when, um, what's his name? Uh, what's the dinosaur's name? The I, f I forget the dinosaur's name, but you remember when Miss Park was in the room with Sangte after Sangte and Gangte had the fight, and then yeah. Sangte told her the story about, yes. like, oh, this is like the adoptive, they're not the same mom. But then Gangte said, oh, he only tells that to people he's close with. What the fuck does that mean? Remember, he, said, he, he told that to the person who killed his mom. Shit. I'm, I am so fucking confused now. Okay, oh, so... my head hurts. I mean, I don't know what to say after this. Like, I just... So now she... She who... I can't even talk. She's I'm so, like, dumbfounded. Evil. So she's driving now. God knows where. Because she got the pin on. She's making I, her... I don't she, know. What I don't else know. does she I have planned? I, I, don't, I don't know. There has to be something else that clicked. I, that made her do what I she mean, did. I don't even know what to say. Like, that um, part seems incomplete. So... Like, we just know that Gangte's mom was the housekeeper. Okay. So like, why the fuck did she let's just go her? through this. She, I guess, has been around. Okay, well, she. There, I, there's all right, my like thoughts this. are all over the place. I'm gonna try to organize them right now. So, all right, ladies and gentlemen, uh, this post discussion is gonna be cut short because my internet just went out. So I'm no longer connected to the Discord call with uh, with Justin. So, um, yeah, sorry about that. But uh, what a crazy, absolutely insane cliffhanger, though. Um, I guess we'll uh, get into more of the discussion when we go to the next episode. But uh, that's just wild. I had no, I, I was not expecting that. But um, if you like this episode, be sure that you drop a like on the video for, for that insane re uh, reveal. Um, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Uh, please join the Patreon if you haven't, if you want to stay up to date with us. And um, we'll see you all in the next one for it's okay to not be okay. So until then, y'all take care. Sorry for the technical difficulties. And uh, I will see you all. In the we will see you all in the next video.